hello everybody in this video we will put one figure and one movie in the spotlight and today we'll take a look at Thor the Dark World and I am a huge Marvel Cinematic Universe fan so of course I think the Dark World is a good movie but it's not my favorite Marvel movie but the figure here from Hot Toys is, in my opinion, one of the very best Thor figures. Let's take a look. The figure comes with a bunch of very well sculpted hands, holding hands, relaxed hands, also some extra packs and two extra buttons for the cape, and also this tool to remove and insert the buttons again. Then we have the black poncho that Thor actually wears quite a lot in the movie. And of course, finally, the trademark weapon, Mjolnir the hammer, in die cast metal and with a lot of small great details. To get Thor in his black poncho, you first have to remove the head and then the cape. And then you can display the figure with this different look. So let's proceed with the articulation. The head moves quite good even though the hair hinders the articulation a bit. And then we have the arms here that you can hear moves in clicks. It's like small steps. The arm can bend in three steps and it's necessary to hold the very heavy hammer. But the upper body articulation is the weak spot of the figure. There is another version of Thor from the Dark World movie and it's called Asgardian Light Armor version and it's without armor on the arms. And the articulation is a bit better. But here on the lower part of the figure the articulation is very good. In my opinion this is one of the two best versions of for when it comes to the likeness of actor Chris Hemsworth. The other is the version from Age of Ultron. But from certain angles, this figure is almost scary in how much it looks like Chris Hemsworth. Besides the face sculpt, the rest of the figure is really, really well made. The armor here and the boots and also the cape. It's a very good Quality. And it's extremely fun to pose the figure and display it in some angry Norse thunder god poses. Finally, let's take a look at the box here in the shape of Mjolnir and the Hot Toys figure stand that is also included. This is one of my favorite Marvel figures and if you haven't done so already, go watch The Dark World, even though it's not the best in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Thanks a lot for watching this figure and movie spotlight. 